how to restore old presets into Photoshop CC220. First thing to do, go to the window menu and you've got brushes, gradients, and go down to patterns and shapes and styles. They are the key presets. How to restore your old presets. There are a load of them in 219. Now you've got the panels there. And you can see shapes. You've got various things now with 220. But all your old presets, the ones that come with Photoshop, 219, 218, etc. They're not there anymore. So where are they? Go to the right side menu. And go down to Legacy Shapes and More. Simply click. And then you'll see a group appear, legacy shapes and more. And you can see the 219 and also other legacy shapes as well. Expand the group and you can see your film, frame, banner shapes and many, many more. When well, you can also go to the patterns panel. I'm just going to go to patterns and you see trees, grass and water. What you can do, go right side menu again down to Legacy Patterns and more. Select that, and then it takes a few seconds, and you'll see a Legacy Patterns and more appear. And you see again, 219, so you've got dirt, stone, wood, etc., as well as color paper, grayscale, etc. Gradients, you can go to the gradients, and again, right side menu, and Legacy Gradients. With it's not Legacy Gradients and more. So select that, and then you can see Legacy Gradients group down there. Legacy Default Gradients, Color Harmonies, all are back again. So you've got Rainbow and all the sort of ones that you probably use, as well as, of course, the lovely new ones that have been added. We can do the same in Styles. So go to the Styles panel, and you see you've got Basics, Natural, Fur, and Fabric. Go down to the Legacy Styles and More, Select that on the right side menu, and you can see a group here. You've got the 219 ones, so you've got chrome, metallic, grunge, glass, etc. As well as the legacy ones down there. So you've got abstract styles, buttons, and many, many more. And you can go to brushes. Now, brushes were, was available in the earlier one as well, 219. So it's not a new feature of 220, but you've got legacy brushes there on the right side. So again, go down to that, select that. This time a dialogue pops up, click OK. And then you can see that group here there, legacy brushes. And you've got all your M brushes, legacy brushes, etc. Dry media brushes and many, many more. So that's all your legacy brushes, patterns, styles, etc. brought back. That's all the ones from Adobe, of course. Your own brushes, patterns, etc., are not restored, and you'll have to use the import command for that in the same right side menu. The key thing is the Windows menu and the panels and the right side menu for each panel and legacy. You can always delete the groups, and then if you want to restore them at any point later, just apply the same command. Hope you found this tutorial of interest. Please subscribe to the Graphic Extras channel. Always add new tutorials about Photoshop, Illustrator, Affinity Designer, etc. Please add some comments. Always appreciated. A dislike or like. Thank you much.